This is the flower pouch, very easy bag to use and it comes with pre-cut holes to make your planting a breeze. The big, big thing with flower pouches is to make sure that you stuff them with the compost correctly. You can have a failure with the flower pouch that's just down to the first handful of compost that you put in. So when you do fill, you fill right into the corners. Make sure it's packed right into the corners because if you don't do this right, the watering at the bottom of the bag won't be correct and you'll have a bag that's okay at the top, but the bottom is pretty awful. And fill the bag continuously until the top. Now I've got one here that we've almost finished. Here it is. It's got a couple more handfuls to put in the top here just to finish off. Now, you may be thinking, well, as soon as he puts that bag down to plant it, that compost's gonna fall out. Well, it would do, except that I've got a little trick by carefully folding the top of the bag over and by using an ordinary close peg you can quickly solve that problem. Now I can lay the flower pouch down and start planting. Now the plants that I'm going to put into this particular pouch are going to be trailing petunias. These are young plants and you can see when they arrive there's a well-developed root system there ready to start to grow away into the flower pouch and you simply make your holes through the little pre-cut holes in the plastic, starting at the bottom and just working your way gradually up, making sure those plants are firmly in the bag. One last plant to go in the top there, firm it in and it's off to water it and hang it up. Water in the usual way with the water wizard. Squeeze a corner to make sure your flower pouch is properly watered right to the bottom. Take the bottle out to use it again. And you could have a fantastic display on your fence just like this.